what's your impression of how Australian films are going on the international stage at the moment? Yeah, well, um, I think this year has been particularly amazing, actually. I mean, uh, there is there's a lot of our films doing very well internationally, isn't there? I mean, Cannes this year was extraordinary. I think we had the most amount of Australian films that have been there for 12 years. You know, um, there's a lot of talent in Australia, and I think it's evidenced by just how much we are seeing, you know, Australian films, which are, you know, from a fraction of the budget of uh, overseas counterparts. So, yeah, f great, fantastic. And there's such a diverse slate, really, as well. And you were in Sleeping Beauty, of course. What yeah. part has that played in the general success of Australian films internationally? Well, I think Sleeping Beauty was particularly interesting because it was... Um, it was, a, it was a slightly different repertoire in, in the sort of films that have come out of Australia in, in recent years. And um, at Cannes, it was quite, it, there was a degree of contention around it. It polarised our audiences to a certain extent, or the audiences in Cannes. And it caused uh, a, a lot of attention. There was a lot of attention, so especially coming out of London and, and Europe. Um, when it was screening in the park door. And I think every time we get a film that is Australian, that gets into these sort of A-grade, considered A-list festivals, um, they really do generate a lot of interest, not only for our film, which is uh, very proficient, we're very proficient storytellers, but it's also for our country. I mean, it, you know, it's an incredible um, device for, device or sort of tool for tourism as well. I think it always generates interest in us as a culture and how we're evolving. What's Sleeping Beauty done for your career? Or is it a bit early to say that? What's it likely to do for your career? Or has, has there been a good effect from it? Yeah, it's been interesting actually because I um, I have a, uh, an agent in England and I, uh, I sort of straddle the two countries a bit really. Um, and I, I notice there's a, a more interest coming out of England now since Sleeping Beauty because I think Cannes is such a big event. Um, so it's been it's been great in that respect, but you know I think maybe it's a it could be a slow burn, you know.